The virus shutout card is a lanyard, with chlorine dioxide, a compound used for fumigation and disinfecting water. It is expected that, this compound chlorine dioxide, would kill the viruses around the person for some distance. It is to be weird by any person, like an identity card. The description on the product says, it effectively blocks airborne particles, bacteria and all types of epidemic viruses, reducing the chance of being infected or infecting others. It is suitable for everyone, especially people with low immunity, kids, elderly, and those exposed to hospitals. The product claims that, the chlorine dioxide inside the necklace, can produce a strong bactericidal and disinfection effect around the wearer, thereby killing viruses including COVID-19, is completely unsubstantiated. This claim is false, of course. Scientists have established that, the coronavirus primarily spreads through close contact, via tiny droplets emitted when people talk, cough, and sneeze, though it can also be airborne and travel distances over six feet. Preventing COVID-19 spread requires, wearing a mask, washing hands, social distancing, and disinfecting surfaces regularly. In March, the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency, EPA, banned the sale of this product, which is manufactured by a Japanese company called, Tomit. In June, the EPA ordered Amazon and eBay, to stop selling it. Despite the bans, the necklaces are not hard to find. Facebook still hosts a group, that advertises the product. Chlorine dioxide is a manufactured gas, that does not occur naturally in the environment. It is used to disinfect drinking water. Breathing chlorine dioxide can cause nose, throat and lung irritation, and ingesting large amounts of chloride salts, which form when chlorine dioxide interacts with water, may irritate the mouth, esophagus or stomach.